Hello and welcome to Templin Freestyle, where the Templin Institute plays uh, whatever they want. And today what we want is to play Battlestar Galactica Deadlock, and we're giving away keys, and I am joined by the voice of the Institute, Larissa. How's it going? Oh, it's going just fine, thank you. Ooh, you sound odd. Were you doing some sort of accent there? <laughs> well, a voice, not an accent. Well, yeah, it sounded like fancy, a fancy God. accent. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, I picked up on some of that. <laughs> Alrighty, All right. so, uh, we're here with Space Doc, but not quite yet. Should we head over to, uh, wherever he is and see what's up? Yeah, let's warp through to see Space Doc. Alright, hold on, folks. Hi, Space Doc. Hi. Is he even here? Uh-oh. Oh my god, it's possible that nobody's been able to hear me this whole time. Uh, well, the stream will have heard me, but... Push oh it. yeah, we've been talking to our stream, but you guys might not have heard us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Again, I've been Ooh. forced onto the key just touched to a completely floss the ability to speak right there. The <laughs> you know, at, at this point, I, I don't know what to expect, but it's it's always... <laughs> yeah. Entertaining. I'm doing this, but I'm going to move these crunchy biscuits away from the microphone so you can let go of it whilst I do that. Okay. Okay. Oh my Blah. god. What the heck was that? Okay, biscuits relocated. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that anymore. They're gone. See, push the talk's going to be super uh, inconvenient for Alistair because I'm going to have to hold it to guess when he wants to speak and hold the button down. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot our, our, our stream would have heard all of that. Maybe I should have done a write-up to him. Uh, apologies, stream. Yeah, that was Dan's idea. He thought it'd be funny. Oh, good. <laughs> okay. Okay, um, chat? Our chat seems to be a little confused about what keys were given away. So, Space Doc, do you want to fill them in? Ah, so uh, we're going to be giving away keys for the console versions of this game, which has just been made available, or so I'm told. Um, uh, Templin, the Templin 2.0 or whatever, the, the, the two Templins, famed... Um, <laughs> you know, Larissa and Mark, that's fine. <laughs> we got names. <laughs> are going to be giving away the Xbox One codes, of which there are five, and we're going to be giving away five PlayStation 4 codes. This is for the, the base game. And uh, we'll do trivia questions and such after matches, and um, first person to answer correctly will receive a code, as has been in previous streams. Yeah, uh, I've got a question, super quickly. Go for it. Is this part of your Colonial Cup uh, series? I think it should be. Oh, should it? Is this because they've added a bunch of ships to the game? <laughs> I've <laughs> won the past, like, 40 or 50 games, and none of them have counted towards the cup, which is bullshit. So <laughs> I think they should be counted from now on, man. Okay, well, fine. I we, mean... we can count this one because Anthony told me how to beat Scorpion platforms, so let's see how this goes. <laughs> uh, well, our now playing graphic doesn't say that it's Colonial Cup. Oh, sh oh. shit. No, so it... I guess the whole thing's just call it off. Everybody go home. The now playing is fault. more of just a, a graphic, guideline. Man. What are you playing on? No, I mean, the graphics are accurate. We're, we are giving away. Okay, we can, we can save this. <laughs> The great game giveaway is just, like, prioritized ahead of the Colonial Cup, but they're both applicable to today's stream. Okay, okay fine. Okay. Um, you know what? I'm willing to accept that it's Colonial Cup, if only because I'm quite confident that I'm going to win. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay, so, let's, let's just steer straight past Alistair's really cool fleet, <laughs> which I accidentally used a couple weeks ago. And won, right? It's <laughs> yes, good, right? Yeah, it's because it's really cool. <laughs> All right, should we should we use one of God's plans? They're all God's plan. I mean, what, the rest. What, what alternative do you have? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Shit, I don't know what I'm doing. Um, you keep an eye easy on the joke. I sure am. Yeah, we've got Phoenix. We've also got B Random Viewer who's joined us as well. Hey, it's who, B Random Viewer who has joined us for that uh, Winnipeg interior. Yeah, he was yeah. asking all the great questions on the Sojourn stream. Yeah. Top yeah. Man. All right, fuck it. I'm gonna ah fuck. I don't know what I should do. Do the good one. There is no good one. Oh, it's too late. He's run out of time. I mean, actually, I'm using like a fleet that's never won before that I think is gonna be bad. <laughs> After a great right. start for the next round of the Colonial Cup. Yeah, fuck. I think this opening game shouldn't count. Ah, he's insisted already. It's gonna count. Do you fancy a rematch later? Against you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, man. Eh, not really. Oh. 
<laughs> you're, you're afraid that you'll have to be sent another gif. <laughs> Holy shit! What? Either Calgary's being bombarded by artillery, or there's a thunderstorm going on that I was completely unaware of. Wow. I can hear it. Yeah, I heard a bit of that. And I heard it through your speakers. <laughs> wow. And that was the last we ever heard of Mark from the Templin Institute. Man, I hope all my computers are plugged into something good. Shit, I think they probably are. Ah, fuck it. Uh, Kralter says, why isn't Larissa streaming The Witcher today? Because it is Friday, after all. That is going to be happening in, um, five hours. So, uh, come back then. Ooh, I'm going to jump on for that. That'll be exciting. I think so. Yeah, I'm always awake in the middle of the night. Yeah, well, yes. So, Space Doc, do you actually sleep? I do, just in the morning. Mm. People, I think when most people come home from work and have finished their day, Space Doc wakes up and begins his. Yeah. So, you're the definition of a night owl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm happy with that. That's cool. It was a good character in Watchmen. By your command. Yeah. Aren't exactly the best examples of functional. <laughs> Sorry, I hope means. Alistair never says anything important at the start of his sentence because it's never going to go through on this push to talk system. That's my secret cap. I never say anything important. <laughs> well, Shit. see, what you can do is you push the button and then talk. I've got the wireless keyboard that controls that, and Alistair's running the, the stream chat on his laptop whilst also drinking tea and, and editing a video. <laughs> Dude, why aren't you just on your own on your own channel? Get your own stuff. Come Speaking on. of our own stuff, thanks to KRG12 for subscribing. Ooh, yes, thanks, man. Yeah. Oh no, my, my Atlas is just... Oh no, every, every single ship yeah. I have has just crashed into each other. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Colonial Cup, this is great. Uh, Space Doc, do you even need an enemy, or can you just, like, fight against yourself for a bit? But what I'm doing here is I'm showing off the new damage modeling system that's been added to Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. Oh, wow, is that shrapnel oh, flying off cool. into your own ship? Yeah. That's quite pretty, I, I, I made this decision so as to best demonstrate that new feature. Wow. Tactically brilliant. I, I know, right? <laughs> you know, Doc, if you're not going to take this seriously, I can just leave. I mean, that would certainly make my victory easier. <laughs> <laughs> Is this your version of like a handicap? I'm so uh, good, I'm gonna destroy half my fleet. It would, uh, Alistair just said about- Alistair just, Al Alistair just said what? Uh, <laughs> How's it going, Larissa? <laughs> um, I'm doing fine. Apparently Space Dog is broken. At least our mics are good. Yes, because we put effort into our streams. I think Space Doc just doesn't care about his fans. Yeah, I think that's it. But we care. We oh, care yeah. deeply. Well, I mean, uh, looks like you're tidying up pretty yeah. nicely. Damn straight. See, when you watch a temp. Hmm. I assume he said something very biting and cruel, but no one will ever know. But we'll never know. Yeah. Clean audio and no biscuit scrunching sounds in the background. Clearly, this is the way to do it. It's got charm. Confirmed. Um. What do you think that meant? You, what you call charm, I call dilapidated garden shed in the horse out of town. Ooh. Oh. That, yeah, that, that's, that sounds like Space Dog HQ. Calculated. That's where we are, right? <laughs> <Sorry, what? laughs> that also sounds like a property that you can buy for a million dollars in Vancouver. <laughs> not even joking. A little bit joking, but not even joking. But you keep mentioning these biscuits. What kind of biscuits are they? Uh, they're what, what you American heathens would call cookies. They're Although crisp biscuits! They yeah, they straight are from even, Bristol! Yeah. <laughs> even we call these cookies. These are the, the cookies. Also, they're Canadian. Shh. Are they? <gasps> they are? Oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> are they maple cookies? Uh, Maryland. What's the they got like, cho they've got chocolate chip cookies. 
They're pretty oh, short. They're not shit. Oh, they're okay. <laughs> they're, not, they're not dark chocolate digested biscuits, but everyone knows that those are superior. Do you guys have digestive biscuits over there? Yes. Yeah. yeah digestive biscuits are great. Yeah, if you're like a grandma. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Um, Phoenix Fire 18 says, what difficulty are you playing The Witcher on? Uh, I'm gonna be playing easy, because that's me. It's Phoenix Fire 18 in both chats. Hostile. Are you playing both sides? Yeah, that's uh -huh. not on. That's not okay. It's because he likes us better. a lack of music and quality, quality control in ours. What, music? Yeah. The music's not there, so you can hear our... Wonderful banter and the sound of biscuits. That's yeah. like part of the experience. Could you imagine if you couldn't hear the biscuits of the sound of music? Mm. Yeah. The hills are alive with the sound of biscuits. <laughs> See, a biscuit to me will always remain like a little baked good, Target not a cookie. Acquired. Like, a, like right. a little Co cookies, cookies are baked, though. No, I mean, I think in America it's like some kind of weird like pastry thing. And of yeah, course, in like Quebec, little... the whole thing's reversed. Well, no, no, no. Uh, it's like, no, I mean, it's like, it's like a but steak bake, savory. but not with the steak. It's like a sweet... A steak? No, no, not a steak bake. A steak bake. Well, There's, no There's no steak, right? There's no steak bake. There's no steak bake. It's like a steak bake without the steak. Throw the steak bake in the lake. <laughs> Got steak. <laughs> okay. Larissa, don't you just thank God every day we live in Canada and not whatever the hell's going on over there? Yeah, <laughs> every day. But I do it's have to admit that uh, Yorkshire pudding Hostile is pretty good. Unit. Oh, Yorkshire pudding's great. Oh, man, my granddad used to make the best Yorkshire pudding. Don't puddings. talk about the, the older generations. Of, you're making us sound rubbish, all right? Every, everything <laughs> we eat sounds like grandpa food, <laughs> and you're not helping that stereotype. <laughs> my granddad! Ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. that, that was good. Now I really want Yorkshire pudding. You know, this whole stream sounds like a police 911 transcript, you know? <laughs> <laughs> just a falling apart all the time. Yeah. Just like periodic scenes of violence. <laughs> oh shit. Revenant. Oh yeah, okay, there goes his other atlas. Fuck you, Space Doc. Yeah! I, I, I didn't start out strong in this match, it has to be said. Sorry, Alistair, I wasn't pushing the button there. Do you mind to send that again for the for the lovely viewers? Oh, I just said that I was disappointed in you. Did you really want me to repeat that for their stream as well? Uh, <laughs> what's wrong with you, you sadist? Um, I imagine there's a lot wrong with him, but let's not go into detail. Thank you for the support, Larissa. Just do what Templar <laughs> does and crash the range of your ships into his ships and win the game. But that only works if you have more ships than that. Otherwise, it's just killing yourself. Well... So, how many how many ships do you have left, Space Doc? More than zero. Hmm. hmm. I think we have more than you. Excellent mental arithmetic. You're you're well. Thank you. I I live for your approval. I, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Confirmed. How's it, how's it doing, Swiss? How we doing? I'm turning off all our guns because I don't think we need them anymore. Ha! <laughs> Hacked. Systems have been updated. Orc. No, don't push. <laughs> Revenant hull compromised. Oh, Can that, it... that's a new. I'm dead. It would only be ah. one more view of Phoenix Fire if you got out of his. Uh, uh, chat and just joined us. Yeah. Have you won, Dan? Is this your, is this is this an explosion of victory? Yeah, that was that was me winning. Okay, cool. All right, let's I switch to full screen for the replay. Oh yes, full screen replay. Uh, see, I have the good grace to show the replay even when I lose. You can do that. <laughs> <laughs> cool. And here we see the lovely new. Ex and shrapnel crashing to the other ship as uh, Dan very kindly displayed for us. <laughs> I 
uh, should we give away some keys while we're doing rankings this? then between you and Temple Institute, the Colonial Cult? Oh, I'm battering him. Okay. It's like 35 2, wasn't it? 35 3 now. I mean, I think I have a, a, a far smaller lead, but if you want to admit to that, then then I'm happy to operate on that uh, on that level. Uh, what I want to know is, do you want to give away some keys now? Yes. Uh, say what? How, how are we going to decide whether we should do an Xbox One or a PlayStation One? Can we do both? Yes, we'll do one each at the same time. Good idea. Okay, let's say uh, you guys can start with an Xbox One, and then we'll think of a question while you're doing that. Actually, can we alternate between Xbox and PlayStation? Okay, but that's that's going to be twice as many matches, right? Uh, no, but I mean like, you know, oh shit, there's a way to do this. Okay, we'll give away a PlayStation, or we'll give away Xbox, we'll give away PlayStation, and then the next round we'll switch, and you'll give away oh, Xbox, okay. or whatever the hell I, is the opposite of what I said. <laughs> okay, now that Mark has, has flawlessly explained the plan, yeah. we're, uh, we're, we're going we're gonna to do that. <laughs> okay, excellent. Cool. I got distracted by me nuking your last ship in a joke maneuver oh, without oh, losing right. a single ship, sir! <laughs> um... I do have a question though. How do we know which chat or like which person got the question right first because we got two chats? Well, I figure like that's why I'm thinking we should alternate. So that way like if you want the Xbox copy, you'll go to Space Doc streams and if you want the PlayStation copy, you'll go to our stream and then we'll switch it every time. Ah. Oh, so, yeah. okay. So it's the same so question for both clarify, streams. Just to clarify, just to clarify, we are doing the PlayStation 4 codes. If you want to win a PlayStation 4 copy, go to uh, www.twitch.tv slash spacedoghq and uh, stay on the Templin one if you want a Xbox One copy. All right, so this round, Templin Xbox, round, Templin PlayStation, Xbox Space Doc. PlayStation Space Doc. That's right, Echo yeah. Mark. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we need, we need to think of trivia. Give us a oh, Battlestar trivia. Um, we could ask call signs. What do you think? Ooh, call, call signs. signs. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, I've got quite a hard call sign one. Do you reckon these people? These people will get it. Yeah. These people will get it. Sure. Okay, and we, we have faith in you, the space dot community. There's also a video on my channel that points this out. So if people have seen that, they'll know. Uh, just okay. to recap before it, we get going here, this is for a copy of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock on either. Xbox, if you're watching our stream, or PlayStation, if you're watching Space Docs. Yes. Okay, um, and um, in the interest of, of not giving away the answer to the other person's stream, just announce who got it right, not what the answer was, until Excellent. both people have got it right. Gotcha. Okay, right, so um, in the battle over the Tillium Moon, in the Season 1 episode, uh, Hand of God, what is the call sign of the flight leader who dies, le leaving Hot Dog in charge. Oh, God. The, call, the call sign. He is only ever identified mm -hmm. by call sign. Jeez, Dan, give us a hard one. So, Xbox for the Templin stream, PlayStation for the Space Dock stream. Some answers to roll in. Uh, how about we answer a couple of questions that people put in the chat on our sides, because some of these are quite interesting. Dan, do you know the name of the first Cylon, as asked by the random viewer. Ted. Oh, is that is that um, the one from Caprica? The, um, it's like Eva or something? Um, possibly. I oh, know, Caprica's terrible. It's secretly Alistair. <laughs> hey, do we know the answer to this, Space Doc? Can you put the answer in the, uh, in the Sorry, <laughs> description? Yeah, I'm like, this question, what? I don't think I should have done. Uh, hold on, time for a in a second. Yeah, you need to put the answer to the Discord, because I don't think we know the answer to that. Oh, okay. Okay, I've sent you a Steam message. Yeah, Mark I just got it. I just got it. Oh, so far no one's given us an answer in chat. Come on, I guys. I think I need easier questions. I, I feel like I probably should have picked a different question. Can we do something a bit more my speed? Like, which shape goes in the circle-shaped hole? <laughs> <laughs> Ah, somebody's got it. Sar Sarkan on our chat has got it. Uh, Congratulations, Sarkan, Sarkan, why'd you leave us? Well, maybe because you have... Maybe they wanted the PlayStation version. PlayStation, <laughs> fine. Um... So, what does Sarkan do to claim their prize, Dan? Ah, Sarkan, you should uh, send uh, a tweet to at McKay Ballister 
which is Alistair's oh. Space Doc Twitter account. Okay, you have cool. to do this because the Space Doc one doesn't have an open message. We're doing it like that. Allow me to put that in the chat so you can tweet at me. Uh, there we go. I don't want to insult the Templin stream, but has anyone on us, our side got it? <laughs> I mean, you could uh, just look at Space Doc stream and then copy the answer, I guess, right? There's a, a, a Twitter yeah. handle in the in the chat. Please send your uh, a tweet to that, and we will send you your code. If you don't have Twitter, send an email to officialspacedoc at gmail.com. Yes. And just to clarify, once again, I'm going to post in the Twitter link. So send a private message to that link to claim your prize. Oh, yeah. we got an answer. OK. Quilter got it. Nice. Uh, ah. So we've both got it right now. So it's Fireball. Yeah. Fireball is the call sign. I'm going to dial down the difficulty from now on, I think. <laughs> Damn well better. Like, what is the name of the Battlestar Galactica? That is a fine question. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, can you pass the biscuits, Alistair? Yeah, sure. All right, so we're going to do another game? Why, you sure will there, Mark. Let's do it. All right, thanks, Space Let's Doc. Let's do it. What, what is going on over there? Okay, um, we're going to contact everyone about these codes afterwards. We're, we're putting everyone's names in, in a private notepad thing, and we're going to talk to everybody at the end. You what? Is there a way to put your kettle on stealth mode? No. Oh. Sorry, kettle on stealth mode? Any boils. Without annoying everyone. That's what I, I do. You can always just not possible. put the kettle on during the stream. Well, how would I get tea then? I don't get it, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> You're talking crazy. This is why Templin makes sure that we have push to talk. <laughs> <laughs> Of course, the chat can't hear the push to talk, so they get to hear the full extent of this kettle boiling. Um, uh, your life is an audio drama. But, like, not a good one. Yeah, that's just what to say. <laughs> so, do, do you want to play a game of Battlestar Galactica Deadlock? I think we should. So, what was that? Nothing. Okay, this time I'm not going to crash my ships into each other. That's the plan. Questions <laughs> after this. I mean, people are going to be watching this because they're Battlestar fans. I don't think we should use 40k questions. I honestly feel like there's more people in the chat, which know more about 40k than they do about Battlestar Galactica. Is that because you saw one person mention 40k? Also because I've seen like a million people say, I don't know anything about Battlestar Galactica, but this game looks fun. Well, if you haven't seen the show, you should watch it. Yeah, yes. watch the show, it's a masterpiece. Go watch the entire show, then rejoin us. <laughs> we'll wait. <laughs> we'll wait. I won't. The rest won't wait. Nah, I, I gotta stream myself and... In... Five and a half hours. You should all join that. If you're a space doc person who doesn't, who isn't familiar with that, then uh, which you which head over which are you streaming, uh, Larissa? The third one. Yeah, the third one. Yeah, the third one. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Plus, I, mean, uh, I also got all of the expansions too. Ah, oh, I've played through Hearts Hearts of Stone. Is that the one? Mm -hmm. I haven't done Blood and Wine yet. Though. Apparently, Blood and Wine's like like bigger than the main game. Yeah, it's supposed to be Colossus. Yeah, it's, it's gonna take a long time for me to get through the winter. It is pretty huge. Confirmed. Let us know in the chat if you use push to talk push when to talking to your friends on voice chat. <laughs> Just uh, so you know, you will be uh, massively vindicating my argument where you say that you don't. Uh, Sarek, Sar Sarek has subscribed and also said the Holdem Maneuver is the best strategy for Cylons. Just jump the Argos into a Jupiter. Uh, we've I, done that. I love that they, they say that as if it's not like the only thing Mark has ever done on this game. <laughs> yeah, it is called I mean, the Mark Maneuver. I didn't last time. Uh, so, um, I think what you should try to do here is 
No. Crash your ships into each other and start uh, with. Very good. And uh, yeah, Buy just take it from there, really. I wanted to give him a fighting chance last time. You'll right. notice that the only time he's ever won without using dodgy jump tactics is are they going to hit each other Dan, again? Dan, 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 what did, just, what did you say? Oh, the, oh Dan, okay, Dan Daniel, Daniel Oritz. I'm now realizing. Daniel Oritz, successful YouTube channel, Space Dog, who's recently got 100,000 subscribers. Dan, what, what are you doing? I've just realized that this fleet is potentially deployed too close together in, in the loading screen and just dies when you spawn them, so... Uh... Daniel! <laughs> oh, God. Daniel. This is too tasty. Calculating. Look at that. I'm almost in exactly the same situation I was in in the last game. <laughs> I think we got a real good chance here, Mark. Yeah, the odds are kind of in our favor, it would seem. Mm-hmm. Apologies, everyone. We will have a normal game quite soon. Will we? I don't think so. Are you just not a big fan of uh, spaceships there, Space Doc? <laughs> no, I don't think he likes them. Otherwise, why would he break them? Projectiles bearing constant. I do breakdowns every Tuesday. Also, special and thanks to... Sh oh, okay, you got it. Serpent Rome has joined the Institute. Thanks. See, I, I got it, man. I wasn't okay. sure if you were paying attention. I'm paying attention. Luckily, I wasn't holding the button down for that night because that was a terrible joke. Yeah, that was that was pretty only tomorrow on the stream. Well, why why do you got to say that? Now I'm curious. Don't encourage me. Well, okay. How's uh, the chat's response to the push to talk question? Um, one guy I feels think... very strongly against it. Like and then everybody the else is like, you have friends? No, yeah, no. we, we had it's someone... It's not me, is it? <laughs> uh, we, we, we've got someone that doesn't use push to talk, but that is due to a lack of friends as well. Oh, great. Yeah. <laughs> Calculating. Anyways, uh, you just won something, right, Kralter? So no, like... that, that was someone else. Or was Kralter at the day uh, when something the temple? Kralter yeah. won on oh. our stream. Oh, there okay. you go. There you go. That's a decent compromise for having friends. You've got a <laughs> copy of Battlestar Galactica <laughs> Deadlock. Play with your friends. Oh. <laughs> Do I want a what? A piece of lettuce. A piece of lettuce? Yeah. I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Do, you I... Do I want a cold sausage? Wrap it in lettuce. No. This is everything that's in the fridge. Well, I, I know, but... What? 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 <laughs> They're moving suspiciously very quietly away from the mic. There we go. Hot Skillfully done. Thank you. All it needed was the Mission Impossible theme. Do you want a biscuit, then? I'm fine, thank you. Still heard the biscuit. The biscuit. No. On, on a sausage. No. no. Do not like green eggs and ham. <laughs> you guys are totally ignoring the awesome fight that's happening. Yeah, you know oh, there's yeah. a whole game going on, right? Ooh, and thanks, Freezar, for subscribing. Oh, and everyone's uh, pressing F to pay respects to Dan. Yeah, they didn't do that in our chat. Don't worry, Dan. Don't look! <laughs> oh, look at that revenant going down. Oh, unless it doesn't. Oh, no, there we go. Uh, Phoenix Fire says, I would just like to state that Space Dock is not accurate portrayal of British people. Yeah, um, I don't know that's, if I believe that. Uh, I mean, the t the tea thing's pretty on point, right? Unless I'm the only person that drinks this much tea. You do take it pretty extreme. What, but, tea? Yeah. I'm right there with you, but... Well, you think I drink too much tea? I, I don't <laughs> want to say yes, but it's pretty close. You sound like you're concentrating pretty hard there, Mark. I can smell your hair burning. Yep. I can smell his ships burning. Um, those are your ships burning. Yeah, that joke would have been much better if I was winning. But... Can you not tell them yeah. apart? Is that the problem? <laughs> the game starts, you're like, oh, Cylon ships! I'll run them into each other! <laughs> I mean, it could, it's not going that well. 
Everyone in the chat, now that the uh, the link to my Twitter is there for people who win stuff, you should go and check it out and then see how the last game that me and Mark had went and then decide if you think we should have a rematch. Mark and I. Let's know in the chat. Yeah, Alistair has courteously not tweeted anything for like four consecutive months to, so as to keep that gift. <laughs> you know you can pin it, right? Yeah, I don't really understand how all that works, so, uh... <laughs> really intuitive. Yeah. I'm, I'm Alistair bad. doesn't do intuitive. I'm bad at a lot of intuitive things. Hmm. Yeah, and I'm thanks, Krolter, for cheering some shlim shlams. Uh, thing for Mark getting a guaranteed win. Two guaranteed wins. Yeah. Someone's made a clip mm. called Classic Dan. Yeah. That's me, I'm Classic Dan the Space Dog Man. You are Classic Dan the Space Dog Man. <laughs> if I had to guess, it'd probably be your ship's car to each other. That's Crashic Dan. <laughs> Crashic. As famously said by Sean Connery. <laughs> wow, you're on fire! <laughs> Quite literally. <laughs> I think maybe that was enough torpedoes, mate. Yeah. Better safe than like sorry. There's Not never enough board, torpedoes. Damn the torpedoes, that's what I say. Yeah, okay, get them off my ship. Play. Should we give away some more keys? Yeah. Do you have an actual good question there, Mr. Duck? No? Okay. I do love how one atlas bounced off the other atlas into a Argos, it looks like. <laughs> Yep, it was pretty magical. Right. What should we do for this question? Um... <sighs> or is that a bit too interpretable to be as much as the question? Um... Which iteration of Colonial Viper only appears in Blood and Chrome? Oh, even I know this one. Hmm. We're going to reverse it this time, though, right? Uh, PlayStation 4 keys go to us, and Xbox One goes to Space Dock streams? Yes, Xbox yes. One go to Space Dock. So you will win a PlayStation 4 version if you answer it in our stream. No, 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 you'll win an Xbox version. I mean, a PlayStation. No, in our stream, we're doing PlayStation 1. We're switching over. Hold the on, stream. hold on, hold the presses. Fallout okay. Kids 567. Can you stop pushing the talk button? I can't hear myself. I can oh, myself. Sorry, that's the problem. Yeah. Okay. Fallout Kids 567 cheered some shlim shlams and said, Hi, Larissa and Space Doc, I think. But really, hi, Mark. You are the best thing about the stream tonight. Damn straight. Yeah. Okay. You may resume. Wait, the stream okay, tonight? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Has anyone answered correctly yet? Oh, what? I mean, I don't know. Uh, no, it's uh, G G G G Griso Knight has answered correctly. Space Doc, I gotta write in Discord chat, right? Because you didn't tell us the answer. Space Doc? Hello? Alright. Sareka. Oh, I'm sorry, I got told off a minute ago for holding the button down, alright? Sar <laughs> <laughs> Ek has got our question right, so you're getting a PS4 code. Woo! For uh, you're getting a PS code PS4 code for Battlestar Galactica Deadlock. Isn't that awesome? Yay! Yeah, contact us on Twitter or and or Facebook. Uh, yeah. And uh, let us know if you're in North America or Europe. Yeah. Yeah, you can contact us on Twitter at TemplinEdu or uh, send us a message on Facebook. Yeah, links are in the Twitch uh, page. Yeah, in the, in the, the description. Yay! And Quilter uh, cheered more Slim Shlams because I keep finding the shiny ones in between the couch cushions. <laughs> Uh, Space Doc, should we give away another key here? We gotta speed things up, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, okay, cool. Uh, another key, sure. Um, right, so let's, it's gonna be reversed this time. Space Doc's giving away PlayStation, we're giving away Xbox. Okay, so this time, Space Doc chat for PlayStation 4. 
template for uh, Xbox. Uh, so okay, let's have, a, let's have another question. Uh, okay. Okay, what is the name of the last episode of Battlestar Galactica before the three-part finale? And for you, Mark, I'll put that in Steam. Uh, no, no, send it. Put it in Discord because I'm not. I'm not the one looking at chat. I'm playing a game. <laughs> Sassy. Yeah. Is the answer the Last Jedi? No. <laughs> Great. The dot com forward slash McCabe Alistair, which I will put in the thing now to claim your prize. And with the, Ooh, Andrew oh, Andrew Seven Two Zero One's got it right. Uh, Phoenix Fire's got it on our end. Yay! Phoenix All right. Oh wow! Congratulations. And same to you. Uh, so he's just from the PlayStation version, correct? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, please. Uh, well, are you keeping track of everyone's names, and we're going to contact. Yes, everyone. I am. Yes, I am. Okay, we will contact you at the end of this stream. <laughs> okay. Uh, should we have another game there? Yeah. Uh, am I feeling confident? Are you feeling confident? Uh, do you know what you have to do, or not do, as the case may be? Well, my, my fleet is no longer spawned in a crash position, so that's good. Mm. I'm gonna win now. I'm gonna win this one. I have to do tea machine today. Oh no, I've still got some tea. Yeah, sure. No. Oh, so I just found out that I can send people private messages through Twitch, so I don't have to do the whole, hey, reach me on such and such. And oh, perfect. Then, oh, that's oh, idea. I'm just going to send you a message directly with your key. Aw, uh, Fallout Kids says, I, uh... Let me just say, Larissa is the best thing about the channel. Love you, Larissa, and Mark, leave her alone. So. What, leave her alone? What have I done? <laughs> you were mean to me, I guess. When? Does he know which is Larissa and which is Mark? Because you're the one who's always mean to me. <laughs> Does he think I'm Larissa? Uh, I don't think so. Well, this is an outrage. Sorry, what? Systems How's the surgeon go? How is it going? It's going very well. It's yeah. very exciting. It's all coming together. Coming 2018. Launching we've, sentry. We've just been... Launching sentry. Yeah, we've been uh, we've been doing a lot of um, stuff on it today. Very exciting. Which is why Confirmed. I was very busy and ended up having to rush out to get tea bags before this stream. <laughs> yes, because tea bags are really required for streaming. Yes. 
I mean, yeah, they understand. <laughs> I mean, I'm glad you've got such a firm grasp of the situation. <laughs> In Britain, I think that's federal law. <laughs> You're right. Um, Katanak Katanak says, Larissa is the one that is good at Witcher 3, no pressure. Oh, uh, you don't um, know that. Whatever, whatever gave you the impression that I was going to be good? That's balanced probability in it. If you'd like to see Larissa play The Witcher 3, check in with us tonight for Fuck You, It's Friday, starting at 7 o'clock Mountain Time. Yeah, or 6 p.m. for those of us who live on the West Coast, West Coast. Nah. West Coast, West Coast. Piping hot comeback from Mark there. <laughs> By your command. got to your second round now, Dan, and you haven't crashed any of your ships into each other. This I admire your good. Operation. You're learning yeah. from your lessons. Oh, look at all those missiles. Oh. I got more, it's Whoa. fine. Raz the Flash says, left coast, worst coast. That doesn't work because it doesn't rhyme. Duh. At Space Dog, do you guys put your tea bags in the mug or the kettle? Oh, I put the, the what? The kettle? The kettle. The kettle. Yeah, right? The kettle. That's how you cause a fire, mate. Yeah. You can't go putting <laughs> tea bags in an electric kettle. It's just that you're running a current through paper. It's yeah. Also, Anki, is that like a really good way of ruining your kettle as well? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's a terrible. Get idea. out of here, Gaten Dave. Why? What kind of craziness <laughs> is this? Um, Prazar on my stream says teapot. Teapot was it 1706 now? The electric kettle or nothing? <laughs> well, no, no, no. You, you use an electric kettle, but then you fill a teapot and steep the tea in the teapot, and then you pour into the mug. Or you just drink better drinks. Also, I already fucking lost a revenant. How the fuck is this? Because now that I've survived the first round, I can start playing the game. It's a clever maneuver I'm using called survive. I said, Dan, do you like sweet tea or unsweetened? If it's unsweetened, do you... What the fuck? Uh, and if it is unsweetened, do you like it when it is hot or cold? Uh, hot, no sugar. Yeah, hot, no, no with, sugar. With, with milk. Ew. This is the correct milk? way to be drinking tea. English breakfast tea. No, man. Lady Grey Black is what where it's at. Lady Grey? I've... I've had Lady mm -hmm. Grey once when I was in like a cottage in literally the middle of nowhere. In the Middle in, Ages. In in Wales after I was going caving with my dad and we were stuck in this cold rocky house with nothing but Lady Grey. Which was quite nice. It's like lemony. It's cool. Oh, your bummy PG tips with a bit of milk in there, though. Yeah, the it's all about PG tips. In fact, we were thinking about making a box of PG tips our $100 Patreon reward. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, Alistair, um, would you mind chatting with me in, uh, in By your messages in Discord or something? Because I think there's a mix-up with which order we're using for game codes, and I don't know what's up. Okay. okay, cool. Uh, in the neutral zone. Yes? Yeah. Okay. You'll have to use Confirmed. whatever the other text to channel. Text. This one. Test. General. Any of them. Just as long as it's not the locked one. Mm. Okay, this is looking good, this match. Yeah, I've utter faith in you, Dan. Ooh, someone said that hot cocoa is superior, and I think I have to concur. 
I only I drink like cold drinks. With a uh, whipped cream and a marshmallow. Very nice. Mmm. Hostile unit identified. Confirmed. By your command. So let us know in the chat how many turns you think it will take for Mark to lose this one. Shut up. What's this about? No faith in no that. Faith. No faith in that. To be oh. fair, you haven't inspired a lot of faith Squadron so far. Has Mark just pe like, utterly Even penetrated his own ship? Uh, it looks like he yeah. just fired a bunch of rockets through it and then it exploded. Did I? Oh yeah, what the fuck happened to my revenant? God damn it. Confirmed. Yeah, I think you flew th through your own stream of missiles from the Argos. Son of a bitch. Pulling a Dan. Yeah, okay, well, he had to win at least one, right? Uh, yeah. Revenant Hull compromised. Calculating. Confirmed. Well, people are sad Mark hasn't rammed anything yet. We'll get there. Uh, oh, but I haven't crashed my own things into each other yet. Yeah, presumably that's what they mean. Uh, wait, wait, well, for the, uh, the Centrum Creams or that. How about room biscuits? <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Yeah. Okay, I figured out the mystery. Everything's okay. Confirmed. Is that the mystery of how poorly Mark is playing? <laughs> <laughs> well, you really don't have a leg to stand on me. I'm sorry. Oh, yeah, I'm winning this. Mark, how we doing? Not well. well I believe in you. Oh, well, oh wait, has all of this session. been Colonial Cup? Yeah, all of this has been yeah. Colonial yep. Cup. Oh, no. So those two that you crashed into each other, they, they count. Wow. Should take me about 10 minutes to defeat that uh, back set, I think. <laughs> So, do we have any scorpion platforms out this round? We used to, but then they died. Oh no. Dan, since I haven't seen this since all the new stuff has come out, do you want to go through all the new oh, stuff? Oh, so this is added? the uh, the Templin class base star. Okay. <laughs> I like Which this. It's essentially, it has no oh, ballistic weapons, awesome. but it has piles and piles of missiles and uh, one of those irritating tactical jump ram things. Right. Yeah. Okay. They, they watched one of Mark's streams and thought, how can we make this even more insufferable for Dan to endure and put the um, the same complete. ability on a massive and very pointy ship <laughs> that we can use to ram multiple things at once. So it looks like you could ram all your guys just there if he was so inclined. I really wish you hadn't suggested that. Okay. You're welcome, by the way. Argos Hall compromised. I've just realized one of my atlases has, has like flown off miles away because I haven't been paying attention to it. How could you just not pay attention to one of your ships? Oh. Seems your seems command. tactically poor. You tell Wait. him, Larry. Yeah. Confirmed. <laughs> That's a that's a diss. Boom. 
Boom goes the dynamite. Oh, you're, getting, you're, getting, you're taking a lot of damage here, Mark. Oh, I don't think that's not me. Oh, no. Turns out it was, in fact, you who was taking a lot of damage. Oof. Dan. Confirmed. Confirmed. It is quite intense. How many guys has Mark got left? Is it just the base stuff? He's got a Saras DC kicking about somewhere. Yeah, here it is. Oh, uh, okay. Raz the Flash says we're calling her Larry again? We never stopped. Yeah. I mean, unless you guys stopped, but Argos I didn't stop. I'm Larry. Oh, he jumped out of the way of my maneuver. Oh, he just crashed his Cerastes. Oh, no, he Don't attribute that kind of tactical forethought to Mark. It was completely accidental. I don't think it was. Was it? Was it? Mark, was it? Yeah, I was, I was on purpose. Okay, good. <laughs> I still think I've lost, but I think I can hold on a little while. Hull compromised. Argos Keep hull compromised. holding on. Oh, let's now hold we have on that to what we've got. Well, so I let got the go, Avril girl. Lavins. We got a lot. Got a lot of love between us. Hold on. Hold on. Right, hold I think, on. I think to what we've got. Do, 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 do. Fuck you. Fuck you. It's Friday. <laughs> Fuck you, it is Friday. <laughs> I'm glad that's gonna be a thing. It's gonna be great. Sarasti's hull compromised. Ah, uh, shit. Oh, oh, ye of little faith. By the way, uh, Commander Farsight, if you're still watching, can you let me know if you received the code that I sent you? There's also a video about you oh. on the Templin Institute, if you want there to check is. that out. Wait, who? Commander, me? Commander Farsight. Oh, right! <laughs> that makes more sense. There's a video about you. You made direct eye contact with me when you said that. <laughs> what was I supposed to think? Okay, so, so we're um, gonna have to come up with questions now. Are we doing yeah. How many, how many are left? Codes. Uh, uh, two. Is that two Xbox and two PS4? Two of yeah. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. So which one are we doing on our stream? Xbox. It's right? Xbox now, PS4 right? Last time. Yes. Okay. So whoever answers this question in our stream will get an Xbox One, and in Templar's stream will receive a PlayStation One. Yeah. Dan, what is the question? Oof, give me a sec. Drum roll, please. Drum roll. <laughs> Finish this frame. Are you are you saying the question and we're just not hearing it? No, no, no. I'm I'm, uh, I'm still thinking. Hold on. Oh, okay. Sorry. Uh, ah, okay. Who was president of the twelve colonies immediately before Laura Rosalind? Oh, that's a. Good oh, question. I know that one. This is going in Discord just in case. I think I know that one. Oh, yeah, we got someone on our stream, Larissa. Yeah. yeah. Anybody got it? Nobody's got it on our stream yet. I can't believe the Temple Institute beat us. <laughs> yeah, um, that's uh, that's Prazar. Has got it for. Uh, wait, what one did we say that we were doing? PS4? Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. We're just going to attribute this to no one wanting the Xbox. Ah, uh, here we are. Oh, there uh, we K go. K KRG, KRG 12. 12. Congratulations. I'd say the damage problem looks really good. Why don't we just say to message people to message us privately on Twitch? Well, we'll, we'll, we'll message all of them ourselves after the end of the stream. Oh, everyone's names. oh yeah, everyone's names. Okay, cool. Stay tuned, KRG underscore 12. You will receive your code. Or you are wise, knowledgeable in the way of Battlestar Galactica things. All right, one more game. Yeah, just finishing this replay. Right. Oh, oh I forgot to show me that. I guess the thing wasn't working. 
very typical of you. So he always has his little dinky Ceresties so that he can hide it somewhere and then crash things into stuff. <laughs> so that he always has something that's still alive. A tactic based on the complete annihilation of his own force. It's a pretty good strategy actually in Warhammer as well to just have someone like that that you can keep alive and outside the line of sight. Because uh, a lot of games if you can rack up victory points, you still lose if you get tabled. So if you rack up a ton at the start but the last guy gets killed, it doesn't matter. Mm. I had a game like that when I went down to the Warhammer Grand Finals when I just racked up like 30 something victory points compared to the guy's four, but he ended up tabling me on turn five because I just couldn't get my last guys out of line of sight. So yeah, yeah. tactically viable. Who do you play in Warhammer? Sorry? Uh, who do you play in, in Warhammer? Uh, Ultramarines. Oh, fuck I'm you. Boring! <laughs> I'm boring! <laughs> yeah. This is a long replay. You, you really did fart around quite a lot. It's there called tactics, sir. <laughs> Eldar, once upon a time. That was fun. I thought about getting back into them, but... You play Eldar. Yeah. But now I don't have any money because I spent it all on Ultramarines. So... Hmm. I had a pretty fun name for my team that went down to the finals with. That was Balkan Bandits? Oh, Balkan Bandits was our team name. My army name was Ultra Blue Dudes and a Rude Bruce Cruise. <laughs> <laughs> that is quite the name. Hey, Mr. Doc, we going to get a game going here? Yeah, just yeah are we going to move on to the next round? I'm chomping at the bit here. There we go. All right, new strategy, Larissa. Is it going to win? I don't well, know. Having a strategy, right? <laughs> Something okay, like so that. Dan yeah. When I'm speaking, I want you to hold down the button, Daniel. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Excellent. Did you? I was going to say you should use my thing. Alice is a really cool fleet. <laughs> I'm not going to use Alice's really cool fleet. But it's really cool! <laughs> Wait, when, when you won, was it with Alice's really cool fleet? When I won, it was with the the easy, dumb man, uh, just lots of torpedoes on three big ship fleet. You know the, the one, one that I've just used. Oh, all right. Cool. <laughs> you calling me a dumb man. I mean... That's the highbrow insults I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> Um, Mark, yeah, under Farsight wants to know what army do you mostly identify with in the 40k universe? If you say the Tau, I'm going to judge you indefinitely. Valhallen Ice Warriors and the Death Korra Krieg. Death Korra Krieg are great, yeah. Death Korra Krieg are very cool, yeah. I like the Imperial Guard because they're just guys with guns, that's all you really need, yeah. In the meta right now, everyone plays guard, apart from you. I guess. Launch sequence activated. Mark, you're gonna bring this one home, right? I have to I think so. stop collecting an old car. Are you struggling with that push to talk? I really hate push to talk. <laughs> I hate it so much. I Get over guess it. Guess when you're gonna speak and cutting everything off. That's why Alistair just needs his own. Come on. The microphone. Yeah, we're both sitting in front of the same microphone. Well, get another one. Yeah, Dan, get another one. Jeez. <laughs> By your command. Launching sentry. And uh, by the way, for those who aren't sure what the score is currently, we've got two victories for the Template Institute and one for Space Dock. Yeah. Fake news. <laughs> Launching sentry. Oh. Uh... Don't leave his lies. <laughs> None of that happened. We have video evidence of our successes, so... No, you don't. Uh, no, yeah, no, you don't. Do. Correct. Incorrect. <laughs> it was 
It's all video editing wizardry. Don't believe any of it. I don't like your revisionist history. What do we even know about video editing? Yeah, I like it's just magic, right? I don't know how it works. Systems have been updated. I mean, in fairness, when I look at your videos, it does seem like some kind of magic. I have no idea how you do it. <laughs> just kind of shows up, and it's Which done, and then we're like, constant. cool. I guess this goes. Oh, on that's gonna hurt. Shit. Oh no. Oh, that's a really effective missile hit that you just pulled off there. That's quite annoying. <sighs> Dan, this list looks rubbish. Oh no, wait. This is, the, this is the good one. This is the big dumb man one. Oh, you'll be fine. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Launch sequence activated. Launch sequence activated. So, question is, is he using his list that he used to defeat the guy that designed this game? Wow. Guess how he did that? I don't know, some scummy tactics we crashed all the ships into theirs. Exactly. <laughs> Um, everyone is calling for the mark maneuver or the hold or maneuver, maneuver Systems or engage hyperspeed ramming. So. Well, I got to win, and I like we can't, uh, you know, do mark maneuvers at the expense of like victory. You were saying that a couple months ago. Mm -hmm. huh. See that guy did missiles, so I can't dodge him. Can you shoot him down? Yeah, but not with a, a cruiser. Only with flak from a battle star. Target acquired. Yeah, but can't you shoot him down with uh, like vipers or something? Well, yeah, but I ain't got any nearby. That, that's a that's a raider squadron. That's one of marks. Oh, shoot that then. I don't know. Just shoot. Just win, Dan. It's not that hard. That, that, <laughs> I'm, I'll, I'll Ooh, take that, your that, advice that's on board. Good advice there, Alistair. Sorry if you're getting echo. I'm trying to take this off when we finish so that you can speak. <laughs> by your command. Uh, by the way, did we ever figure out? how we're celebrating the official victory of the result of the colonial cup like do we have a cup oh yeah we should make a cup yeah and cut off the corners yes always <laughs> cut off the corners is it the other person we get like a because like if mark wins plas plastic if, if mark wins iron. i can see you just getting like a pot noodle cup and yeah pot like noodle that'll do getting some like tassels from the side of the girl's bike or something and <laughs> stick them on the side does anybody still have tassels on their bikes but alistair does yeah right how else will people know how fast you're going or you know accessorize the basket at the front for your poodle to hang out in all you good have question. a poodle? Yeah. Oh, actually, I have a mental border collie, yeah. which would not go anywhere near the basket of a bike. We've got a border terrier. Um, right. Still, puppy. Like I think, what was, was the dog from Futurama a border terrier? The, the dog from the Futurama like, TV movie? Oh, that famously road. Yeah, yeah. I think that was a border terrier. By Possibly. Your How are we doing, Mark? Not great. I've already fucked up a million times. I'm gonna demand a rematch after this. I can do better. Argos unit offline. I believe in you. After this, you can have a go at Alistair if you want. Yeah, have a go. No, at I don't Alistair. want the fucking B team. <laughs> Confirmed. Uh, you can't put images in Twitch chat, Alistair. Oh. Oh. Alistair is sad. Beyond you, my could tweet, you could tweet a picture of your dog on your own Twitter. Okay, cool. I mean, I'm amazed that that needs to be explained to you, but it is within the realms of possibility. Uh. Uh, Commander Fysite wants to know, does BSG Deadlock have cross-platform play? Probably not, no. Uh, I don't actually know. I, 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 I doubt it. PlayStation's usually kind of uh, bad about that sort of thing. Mm. I mean, just the fact that we're having to give out different codes for different, like, uh, geographical regions for PS4 doesn't yeah, seem to bode well in that regard. <laughs> Projectiles bearing... 
Ooh, Open World Actics is hosting the Institute, and suddenly we have a lot of hearts on our screen. What? Nice. Thank you. Thank you. I, I like the hearts, although it confuses me. Alice has just gone to answer the phone. Yeah, don't worry about it. Hello, mate. Hello. <laughs> Guess he's got more important things to do. I did. I did shake my head, but he went and did it anyway. By your oh. command. That's fine. By your command. I don't have a problem with that. So, and look what you've done now, mate. You've made the rest yeah, upset. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Rolls Nemesis Hall Angus, 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 says, Angus, the internet, the internet, Angus. <laughs> Squadron is offline. Darkworm says, I thought Larissa was streaming today. I am in uh, four updated. hours. Come back then. But we got a, we got, we just got a little surprise round of deadlock today that's what this is complete. Yeah. you can actually stream more than once on the same day i know it's, it's, it's a little yeah. crazy it's ambitious but it's real By your believe me no, no, no. so here we can no, see no, no. my torpedoes closing in on my oh that looks like a pretty serious ship that marks off because i just got two waves of torpedoes from it ah shit that's gonna cost me. Confirmed. Actually, this is closer than I thought it was. My range is gonna die. By the way, I uh, I, I enjoyed um, Lilt presents Space Dockius Rex yesterday. Yeah, it was a good one. He was good. Is that still alive? By the way, I had to go to bed. Uh. No. Oh, okay. I saw there was a disaster around. towards the end of the stream. Uh, the dinosaurs escaped somehow. Somehow? Oh, it was oh, most God. mysterious. Yeah. Oh, I, I'm gonna lose. That's an Argos. You gotta uh, lose? I think I might lose this. Nah, no, don't do that. Unless he runs out of missiles. By your command. Oh, well, this is really close. Compromised. Oh. Mark, you doing okay? Yeah, I'm scared. Are you? Are you okay? Yeah, I'm, oh, I'm really scared. It's okay, we'll get through this, man. By your command. No, I just, I, I can't tell when you're going to speak, so you have to wait until I very obviously press oh, the button, you know, we'll, and then you can speak, okay? We'll, we'll, what we'll do is, I'll grab oh, you, I'll so squeeze your arm really hard when you're about to speak. Right, that sounds brilliant. And then, uh, you know when to press the button. You see the, the havoc you've wrought, Mark, with your push to talk, <laughs> You're f***ing us apart! This relationship's not going to work anymore, Dan! I don't know why you're blaming us. I mean, we just want you guys to have a higher quality stream. Oh, we want to have a lower quality stream. I don't know about you. Yeah, fight the power. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I mean, you do you, boo. Oh, oh no, that's very bad. That was actually really clever. Oh dear. Confirmed. Did you hear that, Mark? Yeah. Daniel called you clever. I know it, baby. Not sure if it was enough, though. <laughs> but it was still pretty impressive. We'll go down in a blaze of glory. I'm very good at this game, thank you much, Alistair. Oh, sorry, did, did, you, did, you, did you give... Did I squeeze your arm to let you know 
that everyone heard that I said that you saw. You know what? The next time we're both doing it, I'm not using Flicker Talk. <laughs> oh, actually, I think I might have just won this. Yeah, fuck. Oh, wow. Oh, he exposed his left side. Oh, good job. Foolish mistake from Mark there. Uh. Uh. Well, shit. You could definitely have won that if you... If I you know, I know. Yeah, it's curtains. There we go. Well, I guess that means a tie, so we have to do another round. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, do you want me or Alistair? I'll take you, Mr. Space Doc. <laughs> okay. I go, Alistair. That's what the uh, internet thinks of you. Oh. More specifically, we do another code? <laughs> yeah, we should do the last code, though, right? Yeah, I'm just going to run the replay while we do this code. All right, I'll be right back in, like, two minutes. Okay, bye. Okay, uh, I'll put the question. It'll probably take that long. Question. What do you reckon? Question. Um... Okay, here's an interesting question. Who is president of the 12 colonies at the very end of Battlestar Galactica? Ooh. you, Larissa. Yes, please. It's not. Is anyone in the uh, in the chat? Uh, let me know if anybody else is that. Okay, we've got. Uh, nope. So far, no. I have no answers yet. Ooh. Nobody's got it just yet. Ah, here we are. Oh. A Heron Lord has got Heron it. Heron Lord, congratulations. You won. Uh, all right, are we doing full name or is last name enough? Uh, last name's enough. All right, Commander Farsight won again. Um, all right. So, <laughs> so does he have now one copy of each console? I think so. Uh, yeah. I guess it's it's yours to give away as you like. Yeah. So, uh, have you now collected everybody's usernames? I have all the usernames that have won on our stream oh. over here. Okay, we're going to have one more match when Mark gets back, and then we'll send Twitter I'm to here. everybody there and get them there. Oh, Mark's back. Oh, by the way, a picture of my dog looks like she's just seen a mushroom cloud over a hill. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's now a picture of Alistair's dog on his Twitter, if anyone's interested. Yeah. The Arthur's class is a very nice ship. You're a very nice ship. Thank you. Aww. Oh, my oh my god. <laughs> okay. So we get to go? Oh god. <laughs> Doors just gone. Oh, they're on the desk, mate. Okay. Uh, Space Doc, we we doing the game here? Yeah, I just like proceed. I'm just getting out of the, uh, oh, the menu. No. Um. Sorry, I'm just in a loading screen. One sec. Oh. Now we wait. I don't like waiting. It's yeah, boring. Yeah, it great. It's time for another round. I want to play. All right, here we okay, go. Okay, that's your input. See, mm, we, at should, least... That's really cool fleet. Yeah, you know this is really cool fleet. Yeah. Okay. Someone just made Alistair really happy. Well, Dan's finally embracing the concept of being really cool, and it's kind of new and exciting to him. But I have a I've faith in you, Dan. Faith in you. Okay. 
Dark Worm wants to know, Mark, do you ever play the Colonials? I want to, but I was uh, assigned the Cylons when we first started, so <laughs> I've just tried Aww. to get good at them. Well, fair enough. I mean, we do have one Colonial fleet. Yeah, I think it's just the default one, though. You're welcome to play Colonials uh, whenever you want. Well, not really a wheel. Uh, let's all talk one at a time, shall we? <laughs> Does That's my suggestion. Because he's pushed to talk whenever one of us is talking. We're, uh, <laughs> you're, you're welcome to play Colonials whenever you like, Mark. But I'm not going to play Cylons because I can't be bothered with all that power distribution. So Um, Fraser is asking, has Larissa caught up in the Expanse yet? Mm, I'm about halfway through the season one. Distribution. I haven't, I haven't watched it since before I left for vacation. Launching Sentry. Launching Sentry. Nothing snarky to say Confirmed. there, Space Doc. Sorry, did somebody say something about the Expanse? What, what was that? Uh, well, somebody asked if I've caught up with the Expanse yet. The answer is no. I'm still halfway through the first season. I mean, that's uh, not bad, given the time you've had. I mean, you're, you're going through the audiobook as well, aren't you? Yeah, yeah. I'm a yeah, little more fine. than halfway through the audiobook, so... The audiobooks are great. Yeah, I think between the book and the show, I like the show better. The sh yeah, it, it is interesting. Like, um, the adaptation sort of adds things, which is kind of the last thing you expect from an adaptation. Like, um, they have they have a bit in, in season one where the whole, there's a, like, where it's just an off-page journey in the book, you see the whole journey in the show. It's kind of interesting to see that. Normally it's, it's, it's things taken away. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I feel like, uh, sometime soon I'm gonna have to finish the first season and then I'll be like, oh my god, screaming firehawks, man. Yeah, there's, I guess there's also the fact that um, Ava Sorrell is not in the first book and she's in the first season of the show. Oh god, I love her voice. That's great. Makes she me want to smoke 80 packs of cigarettes oh. just to, like, emulate her. Yeah, that's Alistair's joke. Don't talk to me about cigarettes. Did someone have a bad experience? <laughs> no, he's just got no money and he's been Fire he's been on friend. withdrawal for forty eight hours or whatever and he's cranky. Yeah. Oh. My general advice is for him to just stop poisoning himself, but he won't listen to him. Yeah. I don't wanna hear it. <laughs> You're strong, Alistair. You can beat it. You're not no, controlling- I, I know, I keep telling him that. I'm not strong. You don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I want a cigarette. <laughs> Hostile unit identified. Raz the Flash says, Space Doc is wrong about a vers uh, I can never pronounce her name. Avasarla? Yeah, Avasarla, not being in Leviathan Wake. acquired. Oh, um, is there, there's like a line where somebody says something about someone in Asare being somewhere. There's like, there's like, she's not a POV character in Leviathan Wakes. And she's, um, yeah. very important in the show. How do you think our chances are this round, Mark? I don't know. Go either way. <laughs> yeah, I feel like you're just saying that to like bring Space Doc's confidence up. I've already so made some mistakes. Pull the rug out. So why are you admitting this? I mean, everything's fine. Yeah. Talking about the important stuff. <laughs> Don't hold it down now. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this so much, and we're never using it again. Is he asking you? But he's asking our space doc. Well, well, I mean, most likely to captain none of them, given that they are fictional spacecraft. Well, what? that's pretty much this. I would be the NX class because uh, I'm sure in combat the best I would be able to do is pulverize the whole plating. Oh, polarize. Polarize. Pulverize the whole plating. You heard what that I said. That doesn't sound very useful. You heard. 
I love the Enterprise E. The Sovereign class is my favorite Enterprise. I do like it. Confirmed. Now two, two on two, right? What? This is two on two. Mark one two, you one two, and this is the final. Well, there was also that big one I crashed into myself twice. Yeah, that's why it's two on two. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one of my berserks just got like ruined. What's that thing? Is that a PCM? No. Thing. What is this? Yeah. Angus has been building Tyranids. Yeah! Oh, did, you, did you find all the hobby stuff? Yeah. <laughs> um, someone was saying, oh no, I, I spoiled something. I'd actually got up to that part in the book, so you, you don't have to stress. But Oh, somebody spoiling things? Yeah. Oh, so I'm not going to say it, because I don't want to spoil it for future people. I mean, it's yeah. season one, so it's been like three years, so... <laughs> three years? Two years? Something like that? It's been a while. By your command. Stay tuned! So, for your question about the Versus series, I really didn't like making the Versus series because it always just becomes completely arbitrary. Like, these, these pieces of fiction were not designed to be compared in that way, and they're all of different levels of realism, and... And what? Alright. I guess I'll never know. Sorry, what was that? Well, you, <laughs> you cut tell out us. in the middle. Wow, going, is push to talk really that hard for him? No, I Because it's really not that hard for us. We have a wireless keyboard, so it's like got an intermittent connection to the so computer at the other side of the room. Why are you <laughs> using a wireless keyboard? Because, because we're at the coffee table, all right? <laughs> Why? Get a desk. Yeah, but I have a desk. You are making this so needlessly complicated. You'd understand if you'd been to Space Dark Age. <laughs> Dark One Water has joined the Institute. By Thanks for joining. Command. Thank you. I you think you just want to cause drama. See, and you have no comeback for that. <laughs> ha! Still no saucy comeback. I win. La 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 la. I can't jump my ships into his ships because that's a Cylon thing. Really? You can't do it at all? No, it's a Cylon. I think obviously. kamikaze is just a, a thing, right? It's a mark it's... thing. Mm. The, the turn button has disappeared. How does that work? Push F to pay respect. <laughs> Is it because I've pressed it? Did I accidentally press it? Have I ended my turn? <laughs> oh my god, I'm I'm terrible. This could work to our advantage. I hope so. Squadron is offline. Yeah, nobody understands the broken charm of space dock. <laughs> See again, garden shed. What you find charming, I find sad. Thanks, thanks Larissa. <laughs> you're, you're welcome. Uh, Commander Farsight said my cheer was ignored. Uh, sorry, dude, you'll have to say that again. Yeah, you'll have to cheer again. <laughs> oh no! Bye, Mercer, thanks I think, I think we're onto something here. I'll just. Commander Farsight, I got topped Tau player at the Grand Finals. What? At the Warhammer Grand Finals. He sure did. Yeah. Good yeah. job. You're talking to a world famous Tau player. Yay. Uh huh. Are you, Yay. Are you still... Are you still Everyone, still... please hold your applause. <laughs> <laughs> I said hold it. <laughs> Nemesis hull compromised. 
You're like, <laughs> you're like referred to as the cooler. What? It was fun debating the cool of Angus. I don't really, I kind of missed a lot of that, but I think you might be some sort of holy figure now. I'm on the space dot community. Yeah. And, and a religion has formed around Angus. Sorry. Sorry that happened. It's okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, who's this new voice? Uh, introduce yourself. Sorry, the introduce yourself. Who just wandered in while we were doing it. <laughs> also, Hello. a fireworks display has just started outside as if it wasn't already <laughs> bad enough. <laughs> uh, I'm Angus, I'm back, and Alistair's friend. We've, we've done streams with Angus before. Yeah, we, we've done, yeah. um, uh. Oh, my cuts out. Well, that was Angus. Uh, and they did something. Doc's friend. Um, and he's apparently also a Warhammer player? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's, that's, that's a thing. But this isn't my proper job, either. What isn't your proper job? Walking into Space Dog Street. No, you're right, it isn't. <laughs> <laughs> See, could you imagine if you didn't have push to talk enabled, we would just be listening to Angus all the time, and then it would just be the Angus show. Uh, oh, Commander Farsight's cheer was saying uh, that EU4 is great, and Mark should play it tomorrow. Oh, I'm terrible at that game. And we're continuing on with uh, Kaiserreich uh, tomorrow. Is that Europa Universalis? Yes. Yeah. yeah. The most that complex like game in history. It's like Total War without the, the actual gameplay. It looks like what Mark's done here is just run everything away and wait for me to die of old age. Distribution. <laughs> I mean, if it works. Uh, Mark is those two blips over there. By your command. Yeah, and it's a display of, of supreme courage right here. Hey, courage. There's no room for courage on the battlefield. <laughs> <laughs> That's true, baby. A little bit. Kind of. Sort no of. plan survives first contact with the enemy. By your command. Say about you four I said you, so I, I said Europa Universalis was just total war without gameplay, which is a good way to piss off Europa Universalis fans by the sound. What do you know about <laughs> gameplay? <It's> <laughs> <not>. <laughs> what I want, yeah, is a game what where I you want just talk to people all the time. Basically a book that occasionally has some gameplay I don't have to think about too much <laughs> and requires me going around and talking to all my idiot friends on a ship for hours on end. <laughs> It's like a dating Ooh. sim, but there's some laser guns in it. I will not countenance <laughs> veiled insults towards Mass Effect in my presence. Thinly veiled, too. Yeah, yeah. Larissa knows where it's at. It's Bioware yeah. or go home. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I was very, very sad when I realized that I was playing Mass Effect wrong. As in, I wasn't talking to my idiot friends. Were you having uh, fun? Is that the problem? <laughs> oh, shut up, Alistair. <laughs> As we've established, Alistair wants games where you just it's all about having the best numbers. I've got to get the best numbers so I can beat other people's numbers. There's no soul or emotion at all. That's not how Alistair rolls. <laughs> fun. I like monsters. Oh my god, can they sound all those fireworks? <laughs> Why are the fireworks? Why are the fireworks going up? It's like the 15th <laughs> of June. <laughs> Come on. They knew we were streaming and decided to sabotage it as best they could. Calculating. I mean, why would you open the window? Close the window and sit down. I want to see where the fireworks are. We're getting told. By your command. Hang on a minute. I'm, I'm making me strategic decisions. Give me a second. Calculating. Sarkan says Mark should play Crusader Kings 2 so he can complain about feudalism and Gavelkin. I played um the Game of Thrones mod for Crusader Kings or Universal, whatever. 
Uh, those games are just way too complex. Like, it took me, like, four years to figure out Hearts of Iron. Mm. Ask Mark if he plays Mountain Blade Warband, because there's a good Game of Thrones mod for that. Mark, do you play Mountain Blade Warband? Yeah, Mark. Uh, at least once. That's, you're supposed to play it for a thousand hours, <laughs> is the correct way to do it. So he's just gonna run out of missiles if he stays at that range. Alistair, talk to me in Discord again. Are we gonna get told, okay. gonna get told off because of how shit we are at streaming? Uh, probably. So Mark's just destroyed one of my ships, which is inideal. Launch sequence activated. How do, how do you feel there, Mark, knowing that you've taken down a... I know it was something Space Doc doesn't enemy. know. Ooh. Why is he well, I would him? ask, but then he would know, so... Yes. What's the question? Uh, what? Why Swiss Knight? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Why, why Swiss Knight? <laughs> Yeah. I used to work at uh, this grocery store, and there was never enough time. To, oh, should I hit my own ship? Uh, there was never enough time to uh, make a proper lunch on your lunch break. So one day, as a joke, I prepared um, like fondue, cheese fondue, on my lunch break, and it was like this whole big production. Like we had placemats and like a tablecloth and all this shit, and I used Swiss Knight brand fondue. And my friend came by. He goes, "Hey, Mark, what's that?" And I say, "That's Swiss Knight fondue." And he goes, "Whoa, I think you're the Swiss Knight." And it was my nickname oh. at work for a long time, because I'm super oh. cool. That's cool. Well, that's sweet. Just charming out. Oh, Jesus, he's got two Argoses. It's all over. Look how rubbish Alice's really cool fleet was. Has he got two base stars left? But they're not just base stars, they're Argos class base stars. Uh, how come he's got two of them? We've only got one ship left. Well, I mean... It's largely because he's destroyed all the other ones. Calculating. You know, there's nothing cool with it about doing the whole I'm gonna run all my ships away and drag everything out tactic. It works. I have to agree with chat that getting your name from Fondue is probably the worst way to get a nickname. Oh, fuck you. What do you know? Oh, that's I know a lot. lot. Fondue is awesome. It's awesome, but I wouldn't want to be nicknamed after it. Swiss Knight's a cool name. It is. Cool. It is. I'm with Mark on this one. I think it's nice because it's about you making a nice thing happen. That's nice. Shut up, Agnes. All right. <laughs> Systems have been updated. No, this is just my favorite nickname back then. Just my boy to is, is the lifeguard. You can call me Gangles. 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 Yeah, pretty much. You mean uh? It's endearing. No, it it sounds kind of like a disease. Updated. It makes me Got feel a bad really case of gangles. I look like a diseased person. <laughs> hey, Doc, do you like uh, apples? Uh, there is no conceivable way I can win this. But, but do you like apples? <laughs> do you like apples? Do, like, I, do I, I like apples? I like yeah. apples. I don't like these apples, bitch! Oh. Yeah. 
Was I supposed to die in that round so as to help your, your sort of line there? Ask him if you want some You can die next round, I'm easy. <laughs> <laughs> you die on your own time, buddy. Launch sequence activated. Oh, I got two it's missiles off before I died. I scratched the plane <laughs> a bit there. <laughs> Directly you fired enough stuff with that guy. I was trying to make an X for X marks the spot where you died. Flawless military strategy. Good and actually, it might not be a good idea to show this replay because it took a fucking forever. Uh, that's a good point. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So my Argoses can uh, reload missiles. Yeah, that's a thing. It's oh, they have um, a munitions factory. Yeah. So while you're waiting for me to run out of missiles, I was just restocking my missiles. <laughs> Oh, that is an incredibly, like, that, there's going to be so many jammy tactics from that feature. Like, you can just run away at the start of it. It's got the jump drive as well. You can just, you can last Jedi it. You can yeah. just run away and maybe we'll follow you and throw missiles at them. That's what I did. It's typical. Bloody typical. Bloody typical. Right, so I think we've done all the codes, right? Yeah. 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 Well, uh, I've got five names here. Excellent. We'll get in touch with those people immediately. All right, I guess we won't watch the entire replay here. Let me skip out, or I can speed it up. I can't speed it up, I can only speed it down. Okay. Well, yeah, that'd, shit. that'd be like a five minute replay. Yeah, so we'll call it here then, folks. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Nice to meet you, Sue, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, nice to meet you, Angus. Uh, if you're on the Templin stream, we'll be back tonight for Fuck You, It's Friday, where Larissa is playing The Witcher 3. Ain't that right, Larissa? Oh, that's so right, Mark. And this time I'm going to be hosting, so I'm going to be saying the intro and telling you when to shut up. Yeah, yeah. It'll be like when we're off stream. Yeah. <laughs> Alrighty, thanks for joining us, everybody. Yeah, thank, thank you. Much, everyone. Thanks for having us.